with Mbappe linked to a move to Real Madrid or even could be their signing by the time this video comes out, we see what would happen if Kylian Mbappe goes to Real Madrid. Kylian Mbappe, he's got crazy stats, he's 21, we've simmed a year into the future when he's been at Real Madrid, I'm going to see how they get on. So unfortunately in the league, Mbappe and Real Madrid finished second in the first season, they were four points off Atletico Madrid in first. Very disappointing start for the main man, Mbappe. Goals as well, he's not in the top three, he was ninth for goals, scoring 13. So not too much less than the top scorer, Aguero, but still just a put in nonetheless. So domestically not great. Let's see how Mbappe got on himself. So Mbappe in all comps got 12 appearances in the Champions League with 4 goals, 3 assists. So a really good performance at the top level. 29 appearances in La Liga with 13 goals, 4 assists. And 1 assist in the Spanish Cup. So let's see how we did in the Cups as well for Real Madrid in the first season. So they had a pretty nice group actually with Salzburg, Shakhtar and Marseille. Won 5 games and drew 1, getting 16 points. So a really good total. Easily through, nice and easy. Super Cup didn't go well. They lost 2-2 on penalties to Barcelona. Spanish Cup third round got through, got through the fourth round 3-1, but unfortunately went out to Granada 2-1. So just a Champions League left. First knockout game won 3-2. Nice. And a second game winning 3-0 as well. So a good performance there getting through the first round. Getting into the quarters, a 2-0 loss to Bayern Munich. Looks a bit desperate. For the Frenchman. But a 3-0 amazing win at home. Means they went through. Next you had Man City. And again losing 1-0 with a Bernardo Silva goal. Let's see if they could bring it back. And in the second leg a 3-0. Mbappe getting one of the important goals. Fantastic 3-0 win at home. Comeback Kings in the Champions League this season. Barcelona Cup Final. And they won. 2-0, so Mbappe got his Champions League trophy, leaving PSG, possibly proving he made the right move. So we're going to move on to the second season and see how he got on there. So in the second season, a fantastic performance. Real Madrid got 93 points, beating Barcelona by 4 points, 29 wins, 6 draws and only 3 losses. And against some decent teams as well. So not a bad season at all. Mbappe got his league trophy as well. Champions League and a La Liga. Absolutely fantastic. Goals his fifth this time. So moving up 17 goals this year in the league. So an improvement there. Mbappe this year got 24 goals and 9 assists in all comps. 4 and 3 in the Champions League again. So good performance there. 1 goal in the Super Cup and 17 and 4 in La Liga. So a nice performance there from him. Let's see how they did in the Cups. So in the Euro Super Cup they actually lost. Mbappe did score but it wasn't enough. Bit disappointing there. Club World Cup semi-final won 3-0. A brace by Mbappe proving how good he is and they won the final as well. So a Club World Cup for Mbappe too. Mbappe scoring one of the goals as well. Super Cup semi-final didn't win. But I'm sure they'll be happy with that. Champions League had Bayer Leverkusen, Tottenham and Quarabag. They had six games. They won four. Beaten Bayer and Carabag twice. And drawn with Tottenham 1-1 one, one each time. That sent them through to the first knockout round against Dortmund. They won 1-0. And did well because they had two men sent off. Second game won 3-1. So nice victory there. The old rival PSG who we left, a 1-1, and then a 3-0 to 
Mbappe scoring two goals against his former club, showing him he made the right move. Unfortunately, it wasn't enough. Juventus beat them 2-0 and 4-1. So, disappointing there. They didn't do very well. But, you know, they were champions last year. It's not all doom and gloom. And we move on to the third year and another win for Mbappe. Real Madrid got 104 points, only losing two and drawing two and the rest wins. Fantastic. Very high score. Won easily compared to their rivals. And the map is climbing up the goal table with 18 this year in third. So he's progressing year on year. All comps, his goals and assists are going up as well. 25 goals this year and 7 assists. 3-1 and one in Champions League, 18-5 and five in the league and 3 in Spanish Cup. So let's see how they get on in the Cups. Super Cup semi-final beat Atletico 2-1 Mbappe and Pogba. So Pogba's joined since. And then a penalty shootout with Barcelona, which they won. Poor Pogba missed, but everyone else scored. So they won that. Fantastic. So that adds a Super Cup and a La Liga so far. Spanish Cup semi-final versus Real. Did they get to the final? Yes, but they lost 4-3. A mad game against Atletico Madrid. So let's see how they did in the Champions League. So they had City, Sporting... Quite a tough group, didn't finish first this time, 1-4 against the other teams, but two losses to City. But, you know, City are a good, good team. First knockout round, PSG, a 1-1 draw, Harry Kane there now, and a 3-1 defeat. So PSG got a bit of revenge on Mbappe there. But overall, Mbappe at Madrid really rejuvenated them. They won so much, they won the Champions League, two La Ligas, Super Cup and a world club world cup so that is absolutely fantastic mbappe absolutely smashed it you can see his goals and assists going up year on year and he's amazing but hopefully we see that in the future so please like and subscribe if you like the video and let me know if you have any recommendations and i'll see you all soon